WTFNN. Headline news update. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien, coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida, 1 p.m. Eastern time on Tuesday. Three hours left to go in the trading day, and we got a positive market, quite a change from yesterday. Right now, Dow up 296 points, trading 25,622. You get the NASDAQ up 108 points, trading at 77.56, and the S&Ps up 39 points, trading at 28.46. Dollar index up 200 ticks at 97,320. Notes and bonds, a little bit of lower price, higher yield. 10 year note, negative three ticks, 124.10. 30 year bond, negative nine ticks, 149.06. Gold pulling back a bit off $5.50 at 12.9630. And you got oil up 93 cents at 61.97. We'll start things off. Let's jump over to the future market. We'll start it off with the Dow. It's been quite an acceleration since about 9.15 this morning, trading 25,373. We make it all the way up to a high of 25,651 about an hour ago in the Dow, currently just under that level, 25,606. NASDAQ 100, 74.39. We made it to 74.52 right at about noon Eastern time. S&Ps near the highs as well, 28.46. And backing it up for a little bit of context in the S&Ps, there's yesterday's action. And that is backing up to Friday. Friday, 28.87, made it down to about 2,800. So we've clawed back almost half of those gains, uh, half of those losses, excuse me, that we had in the first two days of the week. Excuse me, as we had yesterday, first day of the week, today being the second day of the week. Gold contract, 12.96. We're up there at 1,300 briefly this morning. Crude oil catching a bid, 61.90. And euro US dollar, 112.07. In terms of what else you have fundamentally in the market, Comcast selling its stake in Hulu to Disney, as Disney will have a controlling interest in that incompletely. And as we jump over to the chart to see how that is reacting, there's your Disney chart, up 2.3% or $3, quite a number. Jumping around to some of the other stocks, Apple, quite a tough day yesterday, but up about 1.6%. You got Microsoft, up 1.6% as well. Amazon, up 1.2 percent quite a number and walmart for same uh free next day delivery it's remarkable it's not up more than that up four tenths percent at 100 dollars and 29 cents stay tuned folks steve rhodes coming up right now at the trader's edge dave white live at two o'clock with the power trading hour and tom o'brien live from three till five stay tuned folks have a great tuesday